highlight of my visit was, of course, the call we got from the Prime Minister's office to visit him. So on October 22nd, to be honest, I couldn't believe it, that he could have time for us because his plate seems to be full. And we went to his office at 9 a.m. in the morning. We spent about with the managing editor, Tinsta Baracho, of the Horn of South Africa service. We spent about an hour and 20 minutes with him. Off the record, background briefing. It was really very interesting. What kind of person is Abi Ahmed, really? This is the first time I met him, actually. I, I didn't know him before. I know him, of course, as the new prime minister. I have been following his speech. Unfortunately, when he came to visit the diaspora, also I was out of the country. I went with the director, Amanda Bennett, to to the two Congos and Nigeria. I didn't have the chance to meet him. It was the first time I met him, actually. He's a very impressive person. Uh, down towards, extremely polite, hospitable. Actually, when we went in, he just hugged us. And he knew that I had been away close to 40 years. I think I was away maybe over 20 years. Mm -hmm. So he was really very, uh, very humble, also very candid, uh, very open. And he seems to be quite well-read, well-informed. He seems, uh, normally when you meet head of states, I have met several of them. You meet them for 15, 10 minutes. You have a talking point, you shake hands, go out. He sat down over one hour with us. And he was very candid to tell us also the challenges he's facing. Normally, head of states, when they take, take that chair, they think, say, we're under control, there's no problem. No, he really admits there are problems, big challenges, he's going to face them. But he says also we are going to overcome that those challenges. There's no doubt about that. He seems to be quite determined, okay, energetic also at the same time, but also very charismatic, a very wonderful person actually. After we finished uh, talking to him, he took us around, and actually the prime minister's office was renovated. He showed us actually. We said, would you mind walking through the dust? I told him, Prime Minister, if you walk through the dust, believe me, I will do it also. I can clean it later. So we went throughout, and he gave us some briefing, actually, uh, orientation about the new renovation of the Prime Minister's office.